Well, What's we, happening? We need a scoop of the cacao. Can I eat it? Uh, I guess if you wanted to. I'm gonna try it. it smells like chocolate. Don't eat it. <laughs> it is not the texture of chocolate. Like the texture of and then you put it in this thing, which has a filter in it. And then once that's done, this is a French you press. Put it on top of your cup. It's not cute. Well, Don't they have me. cuter French presses? Like, yes, they're huge. Like they're like copper. Yes, rose they're gold, huge. Yes, they're huge. Glass. It's super aesthetically beautiful. You got me plastic? This better be amazing. I want plastic, microplastics in my cacao. It's not about the plastic. No! I know. I taught science. Did this come with it? Yes. It smells like chocolate. After looking at what I what the measurement says in this, yeah. it's pretty much Wait, it came with the cacao or with this? With that. This. The I don't French know, what press. What are you pointing at? <laughs> the French press. Hey. Be careful. Okay, I'm ready. Right. Show me how it's done. So now you pour. Do you know how, how much you pour to? As much as you would want in your glass. Oh. Okay. Is that good? I don't know, but probably. Okay, and then you let it steep. Oh, how long? About six minutes. Have to wait six minutes? Yes. <gasps> this is bullshit. <laughs> No! You're gonna spill it again. Do <laughs> me hit myself. You're so mean. What is happening? Ah! <laughs> These songs have grip. We're waiting for it to steep. It's Steepy! Yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> okay. Okay. Now, you take this. Yeah. And you stick it in here. Mm. And then you, what you do is you feel for resistance mm -hmm. as you push. And, you, and it slowly will push down. And then this is the part. Wait, do you have to like have muscles to do this? No, it just takes time. I'm not good with time. I don't know if you're doing this right. Oh, it is going down. Wow. Keep pushing. Like I said, you don't want to put a ton of pressure on it, but you just want to put enough. You don't? Why not? Because you want it to pr press itself through the paper. There's paper in there? Mm -hmm. oh. I can hear it bubbling. Whoa. Is that all the way down? Whoa. Okay. Okay. All right. Oh, it smells amazing. Now you should try it. Like this? Mm. It's not gonna be good like this. Why? Because... It tastes like dirty water. Mm. The cacao's, a, it's a strong, very strong taste. It's not as strong as coffee. All right, that's, this is true. It smells amazing. I'm gonna add a bunch of 
tasty things in there. Like what? Like sugar. <laughs> okay. And I don't have creamer, but I'll put a little milk in there. A little mm. bit of milk. All right, hold on. Let's try this again. Sugar has just been added and frothed in. Mm. Now for milk. Milk has been added. Well, now I don't taste anything. I don't taste it at all. It's all milk. It's all milk. <laughs> A it's, milky latte. It's better. Mm. I mean, the bitterness is gone. Yeah. 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 Sugar and milk. Just how we like our coffee that we don't drink. <laughs> it smells amazing, though. Maybe a, an alternative on a hot day, a cold day. No. Yeah. I'm not against that. It's like tea. Yeah. You yeah. yeah, you wouldn't drink tea. Well, you don't prefer tea just straight. I sometimes do, but yeah, I usually put something in it, make it a little frothy and special, so. And there's probably some people who prefer that by itself. Me kid. Yeah. yeah. And there's other flavors. I like coffee. <laughs> I thought I'd switch it up. We're gonna go, <clears throat> sorry, with cherry blossom. Sean drank the rest of the cacao. It's not like I didn't like it. It was actually very tasty, but I still need my matcha fix. So we're gonna go with matcha. I don't wanna like go crazy with the caffeine or the sugar. So here's to cherry blossom matcha today. amazing the cherry blossom is. It is literally so good. Chai has nothing on it. I have another chai and I don't know how I'm going to go back to it because cherry blossom. Mm. So, so good. So plan for today. Plan for today. We are going to make apple pies. We are, our apples are ready. Well, they're not ready. I have to wash them and prep them, but they are ready to be apple pied. Um, we are also obviously going to take Suki out for a walk so, and enjoy our Sunday. I'm sure there's other things that I'm forgetting because I literally just listed one thing. Probably finish the laundry. Yeah, that's probably something I should do. Anyway, I'm excited. Today's going to be a great day. It's Sunday and I'm not going to think about tomorrow being Monday. But, but there's this upcoming week. And then that fall, we have a wedding on the 24th, which is fantastic. But we also, that weekend, this upcoming weekend, will be, are you ready? A four day weekend and the week will be a three day week. I mean, there's back to school night in there, which is not ideal, but listen, just saying, it's pretty good. It's a good deal, good deal. Anyway, cheers. Gorgeous Sunday, living for it. Oh, look at that man. Oh. Hi. No. You come, would you just say no? What? <laughs> what? I was gonna lay a pickup line and oh, then- Oh, well, I was gonna say something else and, and then, then you stopped. said no. No, I didn't say no. I said if you could, um, oh. I saw you filming. <laughs> anyway, uh, Suki and I are taking a walk. Hubby's going to the gym, obviously. 
and uh, I'll check in with you guys later. washing all of these apples and then we have our beautiful KitchenAid ready. I just have to get the attachment for the apple corer and uh, uh, de-skinner, de-skinner, <laughs> I don't know. But anyway, so um, I have my pie crust ready to go. Yes, I use frozen because it's easier and because I can. I have them from before so why not use them and I have my roll-up ones they're thawing and then I'm gonna make cute little cut oh, excuse me cutouts with them I have some uh what's it called somewhere up there I have some cookie cutters in the shape of leaves and pumpkins and stuff just wait it's gonna be super super cute so yeah that's what's happening right now so right now I'm just gonna wash these apples Right now, I have my amazing apple core spiralizer KitchenAid thing. I have my KitchenAid right here, if you wanna see, which is my favorite. Look at her, look at her in all her glory. Hold on, is she not gorgeous? Look, and Sean got me this beautiful mermaid uh, bowl. More, I mean, just gorgeous. Let's see if I remember how to do this because it's been a year. Okay, this goes sideways. There we go, like I thought. Okay, and this guy, okay, he goes here. means this hold on I need a minute just like that oh, I did it right. oh watch out oops and then the apple goes here Freshly cleaned apple. Come on, baby. Yep. Bring it in there. Yep, yep. Now. Let's see. Oh, I figured it out. Yay. Sorry, it's been a whole year since I've done this, so it's always a learning curve every time I do it again. Yay! <laughs> this is literally the hardest part. And then, the apple is perfectly cored. I put it on my cutting board. Five apples each pie. Let's go.
should wear something more homey for apple pie making. But um, I thought this would be cute, but now that I see it wide, I'm not really feeling it. Let me see if I can find something else. Um, yeah, I think we found a winner. This is, this is gonna be it. So here's what I'm gonna say about these pants. Um, these pants are a size six, which I have been fitting in size sixes, barely, but fitting. Um, the other thing though is we did zipper it all the way up. <laughs> and uh, last time I wore this was, it was a birthday for my cousin. So it was either sweet 16 or she turned 21. No, I feel like 21. No, we were in Philly. I think it was a sweet 16 when I wore this last. Yeah, I was in college. But yeah, cute. All right, I can get behind this. Let's bake some apples. Apples. Ooh, ooh. Look at this one. amazing what that Dyson can do. Oh. Let me show you. <laughs> All right, and we're ready. cookie cutters that were in the shape of leaves and pumpkins super super cute can't find them so I just did lattice let me show you what I did with my first pie that's what's going on in there and yeah that's where we're at so I got this pie making I got one more to go and then my pies will be done It is Sunday, but I will say it was an amazing, amazing weekend. So I guess it's okay that it's Sunday. And next week we have a four day weekend. So it will be fine. We're gonna get through this. Uh, yeah, like I said, an amazing weekend. I finished making pies, pie was amazing. Can confirm. And yeah, yeah, a great weekend. Thank you for spending time with me today. Don't forget to like and subscribe and I will see you tomorrow. Until next time. <laughs>